This is going to be a uh, multiple segment, um, being that we haven't done anything in a long time. Uh, Hi-ho! 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 It's up to what we go... No, that's not what I'm talking about. Hi-ho! The laws of love and the laws of war. Hi-ho! Ho! Like Kempo, fist law. Uh, Hi-ho! Hi-ho! Same could mean the laws of love. Or, in a different country, pronounced exactly the same, the laws of war. All's fair in love and war. Strategy, strategy. Uh, a weapon. Art. Something that holds emotion. Something that might be meaningful, something that might be useful in a negative way, positive way. I forget about that. Hi-ho is hi-ho, and everyone should know about hi-ho. Why? Well, you might have to use that strategy someday. However, knowledge of hi-ho can prevent us from having that strategy utilized on us. Uh, you want to really manipulate the enemy. During a physical confrontation, during a potential physical conversation, conversation? No, confrontation. Or conversation, it would work too. Laugh in their face. It offsets them. It makes them angry. It makes them, depending on the kind of conversation you have and who you're doing it to, remember, the laws of love, the laws of war, all spare, love and war, applicable. What the hell does that have to do with Seon Shinkata? Well, as uh, Master Roy Kamen is so apt to like to talk about, which is, you know, really interesting, the duality of intent, the duality of emotion that is extant in Seon Shin, Seon Shin, for those of you that pronounce it that way. Um, yeah, you're in one breath being very passive and inviting, and in the next breath turning it around and being very aggressive, violent, confrontational. Duality of emotion. Duality of emotion, yin-yang, in-yo, um yo ag -yo. Love is the opposite of hate, but an equal emotion, akin. The evil twin. Laugh in the enemy's face to take away their pride, to take away their straight thinking. But if you do that, you're committing yourself because what you're doing is you're, you're basically driving home a point that you can't very easily take back, if at all. Laugh in the enemy's face. All's fair in love and war. Very good strategy. If you understand the strategy, less likely it could be used against you. It'll be used against you anyway, and you're going to fall for it each and every time. Just remember, you've been warned. Okay. Why is he holding a knife in his hand? I don't know. I'm showing off. It's a knife that was at one time very meaningful to me, and uh, I don't know. I still like it, though. Anyway, um, now for your... Uh, or should I say, my contribution to the martial arts at large. Obi-Tai 101. Remember, you saw it here first. 
If you've got a belt that has embroidery on it, number one, make sure you take it to somebody that knows what they're doing in order to get that put on there. And even then, mark where you want it on there, otherwise you'll never be able to tie that belt correctly. Number two, find the seam, seam down. Find the side that you want on which side. In other words, I got a go-to fist right here, pin. I want to wear that on the same side as my patch. So, I take it, put it on the opposite side facing out with the seam facing down. Wrap it around. Wrap it around again so that it goes over the top, not crisscross. Even it out. Okay, left side like so, right side over the top. Under both belts, even it out. Left over right. Now this is where if you have a wide belt, you want to flatten out the knot, otherwise you don't have to worry. Now, it drapes over like so. Properly tied, OB. Sides you want facing out, facing out. Properly tied, OB. I'd like to see that more often. And if I don't, I was going to say I'll laugh in your face, but nah. I won't do that. Us! Steve Malinowski here. Hi-ho, hi-ho.